this is Legionnaire Mommy. <laughs> I'm back with another fabric haul. And I hope you enjoy it. Oh, boy. I've been busy. Real busy. Anytime I get close to a fabric store, it calls my name. So, I have to obey. But I'm going to start this one off. It, Yeah, all of this comes from uh, Joanne Fabrics. And most of it is from Athens, Georgia or Augusta, Georgia. Okay, this is three yards of black linen. And it is beautiful. It even holds the color after you wash it. And it is so pretty. Now I gotta uh, figure out what I wanna make out of it. And this piece right here is a uh, linen blend. And I've never had any of this before, but it's not stiff. It is, it'll have a, drape to it when I make whatever but I need another black dress so I think I'm gonna make it out of this piece right here because it have drape and I want the skirt to be sort of full and it feel like it's going so good it has a nice feel to it okay this is a piece of linen. It comes from Joanne Fabric. And just about all of my cuts of fabric are uh, three yards when I buy it from Joanne's. And uh, this piece right here is what they call goldenrod, I believe. I want to make another uh, fr what it, pattern by Friday's Patterns. I think it's by Friday's Patterns. The Sarah, what is it's not Saratoga set. That's the name similar to it. <laughs> oh goodness, it's in my patterns in there. What I made. Remind but, me to pop it up on the screen later. Uh huh. The one with the uh, flare pants and the top with the elastic round here. Say S A U. <laughs> we 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 gonna stop messing it up. We gonna butcher that. <laughs> so Lee will pop it up on the screen. Yeah, Lee will pop the name of the pattern up on the screen when she posts her video. This is another piece of linen, and this is teal. This three yards also, and I'm hoping it's. I'm hoping it'll act right, but look like maybe it's just some of something that's in the contents of the fabric. But it looked like it might have a peeling problem. I hope not. <laughs> but we'll see. And I want to make the same thing out of that piece right there. When I find a pattern that I like, I make two or three different ones. Huh? You, okay with the door? you can fast shut it if you want to, but uh, it can stay open. Mm -hmm. We get a breathe every once in a while. Mm -hmm. And this right here is a red linen blend. It's from Joann's also. And it's three yards. And it has sort of like that drape I showed you with the black piece. It drapes. It's not stiff. Okay that piece right there. I think it's real pretty. Okay. And this said linen, but it is really thin. I think I'm going to make a shirt. You can see through it. But it says linen. And I'm going to make a probably a long shirt out from one of those simplicity patterns that I showed. But uh, she'll probably match it up for me and make a suggestion and I changed my mind all the way around. And this is another piece of the same teal that I got. It's linen also. I'm trying to stack up on my linen. 
Yeah, that piece there is pretty. I hope it's, yeah, it's okay. It's the same color as the other piece. Well, the other piece is a little darker, I believe. But it look like the same, don't it look like, the, no. It's two different ones, they different. Oh, okay. Mm hmm Stack getting out of here. And this is the white linen, I believe. You're not gonna see it very well. No, it's not. No, it's not. I take it back. That's my white twill. Right there. You can't see it that well, but it's white twill. And I don't know what it's gonna be. But I try to keep it covered. Okay. <laughs> okay, we doing a little shuffling about. All right. Now, this is that uh, stretch knit. What is it? I always have a problem thinking about. The uh, ath Ath athleisure wear. Athleisure. Uh huh. That feels so good. Don't have any idea what it's going to be either. But it'll be something pretty. And this is another piece of the same type of fabric. And I don't buy too much animal print. This is the zebra. Yeah, there it is. It feels good. Probably hold on to it to fall and make something with it. I got to make some more, uh, what's it called, our sets? Mm-hmm. And uh, this is a remnant. Uh, it's uh, stretch denim, but it's only a yard. And I'm gonna make some white shorts with this one right here. I know what I'm gonna make out of this, probably this afternoon. And this is another piece. It's all oh, his shy of a yard, a few inches shy of a yard. And it is a 90% polyester, 10% spandex. Hmm. It's just enough to make a little simple top. But that's pretty. Right there. It's gray and, gray and black. I think that's gray and black. As Legionnaire said on our video back, a few videos back, my glass is spotting a me one. <laughs> and I bought this piece right here for one of the blouses. <laughs> you might have got a glance of honey there. I didn't know he was back there. <laughs> this piece right here. That piece right there. That is so pretty and flowy. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? And that has a small amount of stretch in it. Not much, just a little bit. But that is a, it said a polyester, but it's a silky type polyester. Yep. Okay. I got sweat running down my face like tears. <laughs> wow. Okay, here we go. And this piece right here, it was on the uh, discount table in Joann's. And uh, I got all of it. It's six yards. What I'm gonna make, I don't know. I know a top is coming out of this right here. 
and I don't know what else. Maybe shorts before the summer is over with. But that's what that's going to be. And that is also the uh, athleisure wear. <laughs> but it was like, uh, I think $12.99 a yard, and they had marked it down for 75% off. And I think it was the gray dot, green dot, one of them. But anyway, it was 75% off. And I got all of it. And leave none to share. This was also on the uh, sale table also. I bought this because of her legionnaire. <laughs> she liked this stuff kind of thing and it says too cool for earth <laughs> got her little aliens on it <laughs> might be coming home with me yeah. it might be going to dragon con with me yeah i think i got about six yards or more of this one but i said if she didn't want it i would uh make some kind of top for myself just a minute, we got to transfer some of this over. <laughs> All right. Mm -hmm. Now, this piece right here was also on the uh, markdown table. It's a keepsake calico. And I got, ooh, I think it's four and a half, I believe, of this one. She's not going to get this piece. <laughs> this is mine. It's 100% cotton. I think I want a button-down dress. Short sleeve. And this right here, <laughs> I saw uh, Sochi Designs. And she had just been to uh, Joanne's in her hometown. And she said she got this, and she wished she had got some more. So she went back to her Joann's, and she got the rest of it. And I went to Augusta <laughs> the next day and saw it. And I think I beat her. I did better. Mine was only a dollar a yard. And I got eight yards. <laughs> but I didn't pay but a dollar a yard. I think she paid two or three dollars a yard. I paid a dollar a yard for mine. Yeah. Okay. And that's the end of my fabric haul. And I enjoyed making the videos. And I hope you enjoy watching the videos. And see something you like and make you a trip to Joann's and shop. And I just wanted to show you some of the things I make out of the sewing machine fabric that I get from uh, Jeff Sewing Center in Augusta. I go so regular and get my machine. They know me real well. I made a mat to go under my sewing machine. Am I holding it right? Oh, look at me. Little mats like this. Either a sewing machine covers to match it. I put this under my sewing machine to make the cover to go on top of the sewing machine. And make a pin cushion to match. That's what I spend my days doing. <laughs> When I don't want to sew a project, I just, a big project, I make small things like that. <laughs> All right. This is the end of my video, and I hope you enjoy it. And I will be back soon. I don't think I stay away as long till the next time. <laughs> All righty. All right, that is it. Um, if you like this video, click the thumbs up button. Don't forget to subscribe and also hit the notification bell so you'll be notified each time I post a new video. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.